Hello, thanks for watching today. I'm Libby from LibbyStamps.com and I'm bringing you another brush technique today. And I don't have a card finished because we're actually going to make a card out of the sample that we make. So I'm using watercolour paper which is 9 centimetres by 13.3 centimetres and I'll put imperial and metric measurements on my blog. And we're using the brusho from Stampin' Up, gorgeous, gorgeous product. And we're using a non-Stampin' Up product called Bubble Wrap. Great for stress release, I'm told, by pressing the bubbles. Anyway, so we're using that and a Stampin' Sprit. And of course, the brusho. We're also going to make a card with Epic Celebrations, which is the free celebration product. When you spend $90 or more, you can choose that out of the celebration brochure. And we're using basic black archival ink for our stamping. We're going to take the push pins out and just sprinkle on some brush show. So this is the Prussian blue that I've put on it. And we might go for some brilliant red as well. And I'm just going to go with the two colours today and see how that goes. And I'm trying to spread it so that the card is pretty much covered in colour. So I don't know if you can see that. Let's see if I can bring you in a bit so you can see that. And then I'll take you out again. Now, here's where our bubble wrap comes in. You want it to be at least as wide as your piece of card. So at least as long and as wide as your piece of card. And then what you're going to do on the bubble side up, so with the bubbles facing up, you're just going to spray with water, making sure it's fairly wet. And then just pick it up and pop it on your watercolour paper that's got the brush show on it and press down fairly hard so that the water that's on the bubble wrap actually activates the brush show. So I've obviously missed a few spots here so what I'm going to do is carefully fold that back and with my stamp and spritz on I'm just going to spray along the bits that I think I missed before and then just pop it back over and place it back down. So I'm pressing fairly hard to get that effect and I think I've done it. Alright, lift it back up. You can just clean that off with a paper towel and use it again. And we've got our background. Now I'm just going to dry that off with my heat tool. So I'll be back in a second when I've done that. All right, I have it dry now, so I can move the paper towel out of the way, and I think you'll like, quite like that effect. And it's quite sort of modern looking, isn't it? So that's using Prussian Blue and Brilliant Red from the brush up. And I decided I would mount it on Rose Red, and then on Night of Navy onto a white card base but before I do that I need to do some stamping and I'm using the guitar basic black archival ink so stamp down and make sure you've got your image well inked to your watercolor paper then of course we need to have a sentiment don't we from this step set I'm going to use here's to an epic celebration because I think it would make a nice playful looking birthday card. Ink it up and I might put it up here. I've got these headphones here also in the set. So I'm just going to put those. That's my card. Now I am going to also use the headphones on the outside of the envelope and on the insert. I'll just bring those in. So it's I've got a portrait card. So here are my two pieces. And I'm just going to ink that up. Pop that down there. 
and then envelopes done and so it's the insert of our card I like to have an insert so you've got something to write on and having the image there just helps as well all right so i'm going to load all this up but before i do that because there's a lot of pink in it it sort of looks a bit more girly doesn't it so i might get some ribbon right so i've got the gingham ribbon so you just want enough to go around your card and i'll add a bit of a bow to it as well so i'll just quickly tie the bow yes i am using my bow tying tool having a few issues with my left hand at the moment so the tool is helpful all right i'll just knit up those ends all right so there's our bow here's our ribbon now i'm just going to use some tear and tape to adhere that to the back of the card and here's where your grid paper can come in handy so if you line your card up line your ribbon up on your grid paper pop your card down make sure it's sort of straight like that your ribbon's already lined up so all you've got to do is turn that up pop that on turn that one up pop that bit on done all right bit of liquid glue really quite a quick technique the brush over with the bubble wrap and it looks quite effective let's move that over a bit so it's not quite on the guitar stick that down right flip it over a bit more liquid glue you really only need a little bit of liquid glue just a fine line all the way around stick it on the night of navy and yeah you can buy supplies in my online store now as i said before this product this epic celebrations is free with a 90 dollar order so you can make your order through my online store you can go to Lib uh, libbystamps.com and click on the shop button and um, yeah you'll be right to go all right so there's our card base and it's in whisper white and i'll just stick the insert in and you can go in and use your markers if you want and color your um, headphones in or you could use ink and a blender pen i'm not putting this on foam adhesive this time all right then we have our card and i'm just going to add the glue dot to the bow that i tied earlier and we'll have our card finished i'll add a couple of glue dots here one to the top one to the bottom perhaps put it about here all right there's our card finished epic celebration with the insert done and the envelope done and it's done with brush oil and bubble wrap stamp and spritzer watercolor paper knight of navy card uh, knight of navy gingham ribbon rose red card and whisper white card all right so don't forget to shop with me if you like this video give it a thumbs up please better still subscribe to my channel or leave me a comment all right that's it for now thanks for stopping by bye for now it'll take creation imagination try to draw outside the line let us see inside your mind You'll find inspiration All I'm saying is you can do it I wanna hear you say